What are you doing? You stopped the car. Are you crazy? Well, he jumped the stop sign. We're not on traffic detail. I forgot. I did it from force of habit. Force of habit. After all we went through. Don't worry. I'll just ball him out and I'll let him go. Whatever you do, don't give him a ticket. Don't worry. Leave it to me. <laughs> don't give him a ticket. Uh, you jumped the stop sign, mister. Here's my driver's license and registration. Harold Conroy. That's right. Mr. Conroy, you saved two seconds by jumping that stop sign. And those two seconds could put you in a hospital, or maybe even worse than that. However... Look, if I, I wanted a lecture today, I'd go to Columbia University. Just give me the ticket and let me go. Ticket? Well, well I'm just doing my duty. Okay. Do it. Give me the ticket. What kind of an attitude is that to take? <laughs> I can be in an orderly, reasonable way. Look, officer, you say I jumped the stop sign, I say I didn't. I'm not going to sit here and argue with you. We have a traffic court for that. Court? Oh, you don't want to go to court. It's way downtown. I know where it is. I'm there every week. I like courts. It's the one place where a citizen can get up and speak his mind about the way you cops harass law-abiding motorists. Harass? We harass nobody. <laughs> when a man jumps a stop sign, he endangers motorists and pedestrians alike. And it's our duty to stop him and give him a ticket. Then do your duty. <coughs> Wait, I'll talk to my partner. <laughs> All right, break it up, folks. There's nothing going on. Come on, break it up. Hi. Uh, look, Mr. Conroy, you seem to be a nice fellow. I am not a nice fellow. I am a troublemaker. <laughs> that big baboon claims I jumped the stop sign. Oh, no, no, Mr. Conroy, my partner's a nice guy. He, he just gets a little excited. He also can't write. All I want is a ticket. Look, Mr. Conroy, what will a ticket solve? With this little lesson you just learned yourself? Look, what's the matter with you guys? You stop me and tell me I broke the law? Give me a ticket. <laughs> or maybe you got your hand out. Look, Conroy, I don't have to take that from anybody. Then give me a ticket. Don't tell me what to do. You guys in these big cars go around breaking the laws, and when we stop you, you tell us what to do. He's a troublemaker. That's what he is, a troublemaker. Stay out of this country. <laughs> Now, look, this thing can be handled very simply. It certainly can. Just give me a ticket. Give me a ticket. Give me a ticket. Is that all you can say? <laughs> you have to stay out of this. Well, you're not doing any better than me. Will you let me handle this? I... Stay here. What's going on? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I'm writing out a ticket for you. For what? For jumping a stop sign. Did you see me do it? No, but they did. Then let them make it out. Look, mister, what's the difference? You want a ticket? I make out good tickets. <laughs> oh, now they brought in the precinct comic. Look, wise guy. Don't call me a wise guy, wise guy. We run into jokers like you every day. Look, Mr. Conroy, you said you wanted a ticket. I want you to make it out. I want you in court with me. He's a lawyer, that's what he is, a lawyer. I can tell by the low license plates. I am no lawyer, I'm just a citizen who's gonna get justice done. Give me a ticket! 